Well, hi, everybody from InfoCision Stadium in Akron, Ohio. This is a Bulls digital update. I'm Paul Peck, along with Bulls radio color analyst Scott Wilson, following Buffalo's 21-0 defensively dominant victory over the Akron Zip. Scott, I'm going to rattle them off and I'll let you talk about it. Four takeaways, five sacks, two defensive touchdowns, holding Akron to just three yards rushing in the Bulls' first shutout in six years. And zero points is the most important thing in there. The best part about great teams is that when one side is struggling, the others got their back. And today, the offense had a great first drive, but then really couldn't finish off the drives like they wanted to, and the defense had their back, keeping them at bay in the first half, and then in the second half, driving the nail in the coffin with two defensive touchdowns. Dominant really doesn't even encapsulate how great the defense was today for the Bulls. Yeah, Qaddafi Wright, who had two of the sacks and one of the defensive touchdowns, didn't quite come right out and say we needed to score because the offense wasn't, but he said, hey, we're going to do whatever we can do to help our team win, and two defensive touchdowns kind of changed the game as the Bulls' offense tended to struggle a little bit. It, it never really felt like if Akron didn't get a gift of a play that they were going to be able to drive on that Bulls defense. But it was still a little bit up in the air for a while, and that Bulls defense was so dominant today all over the field in the secondary. The linebackers were all over the place, and then, of course, all the pressure on the quarterback really is the thing that broke the game open. All right, so this is a critical start to the back half of the final six games of the season. There are still the ability to, to meet goals like MAC division championships and bowl games. Um, where do you feel like it's going with one of those six games checked in the win column? Nose to the grindstone, if they just keep coming in with this type of performance in the run game and then also defensively, just keep winning games. And hopefully you're going to poke your head up in November and everything is going to work out the way it has. It, it's been very unpredictable this year so far in the MAC. I think everything, certainly for the conference, is still on the, on the table and they have a really good start to the second half of the season with a shutout. Bulls looking to keep it rolling. Home game against Central Michigan this coming Saturday. It's a 21-0 Buffalo win here in Akron. For Scott Wilson, I'm Paul Peck. Thanks for joining us on this Bulls Digital Update.